at part two because I hit the wrong button. Um, I've one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, I've done all of those. Square root of nine. Nine is a perfect square, so that is three. So I'm going to put that one right here. Square root of nine. Could you have labeled it C? Yes, probably. Fifteen over ten. Mixed number of one and five tenths. So it's negative one and a half. So this is negative 15 over 10. I need the square root of 3 and the negative square root of 2. So I know this is my 1. This is my 2 on my number line. So my square root of 2 would be closer to 1 and it's negative. So because it's negative, I'm going to put my square root of 2 right about here. It's the square root of 2, but it's negative on the outside. So I got that one done. The square root of 3 is going to be closer to square root of 4, so it's closer to 2. So this will be the square root of 4. Or shoot, 3. It says 3. So I'm going to leave that up there. You guys can push pause. Make sure that you have your answers there, but this is what the test is going to have you do. Or into irrational and rational, and then place on two different number lines.